Changing background in Photoshop CS4 Part 2. Working with layer masks to transform your pictures into customized projects may be confusing from time to time since Photoshop has diverse tool adjustments and advanced features to deal with. I am going to show you graphically a simple way to apply a layer mask into your pictures to customize your picture projects. Before you start, I always recommend to fix your work area and close unused windows so you will improve the visual field of your computer screen, especially if you are using a small screen. So go to view, screen mode, full screen mode with menu bar, to fix it. Since you are going to modify your picture, you may want to open just a copy of it and keep original picture as your backup or master file. Let's say that you have selected a picture taken with the green screen background and you want to replace it background by other. The next step is to convert your background layer into a layer. Click right button of the mouse over the background layer in your layer panel and select layer from background. This step is necessary in order to add a layer mask. Now, by using the quick selection tool, create a customized selection over the area you want to preserve. In this sample, the green area will be eliminated later on. Make sure your selection is set to the object you want to preserve. In the selected layer of your original picture, go to your layer panel and click the icon Add Layer Mask that is in the bottom of the layer panel. To learn how to use Quick Selection Tool, please refer to my previous video. Changing Background in Photoshop CS4 Part 1 By doing so, we are going to enable the layer mask. The R that was not selected with the Selection Tool is now invisible so we are now ready to import the new background. In the menu bar, go to File and select Place to add the new background to your project as a new layer. Press Place to approve it, and a new background will be placed on top of your layers so just drag it down. In order to enhance the picture, let's try something else by highlighting the contour of your selection. In your layers panel, subtract the mask from your selection by clicking the right button of your mouse over the layer mask thumbnail. Your selection will be displayed. Next step. Select the layer thumbnail, and in the menu bar, go to, select, modify, and choose the border range. 20 pixels for example. Press OK and you will see the new selection highlighted, so, just copy this selection, and paste it in front of your previous layer. Your new contour around the object, might look dark, so, Go again to Menu Bar, Adjustments, and select Exposure. The Adjustment window will pop up, so, now increase the exposure until the contour looks white. In addition, you can place any other object in PNG format, or layer files, to personalize your picture, Make some other adjustments, by going to, Filter, Blur, so you can adjust the Gaussian Blur. You can also set the opacity of the contour. And now just save your project in a layer format like Photoshop PSD, so you will be able to edit any layers later on. I hope this basic tutorial can help you to improve your skills on Photoshop. Thanks for watching.